Well, the Walker administration defending a policy some say is shutting down free speech at the Capitol. News 3's Theo Keith is here to explain. And Theo, it sounds like things got pretty heated out there today, huh? Well, they did. Emotions ran high at a question and answer session about the uh, rules. It's all over the administration's new policy to force protesters to get a permit in advance. Opponents say it's just a front to arrest those who don't agree with the governor. On the seventh day of this, Walker took from us. As the Solidarity Singers start their daily Capitol crusade, protesters capture an answer they don't want to hear. If somebody's complained that the noise is too loud, no, but that's, that's not what it says. The noisy debate got heated over whether groups like the Singers are too loud. Protester Katie Reeder says the administration's new policy stifles free speech. Maybe people need to recognize that they don't need a permit to express well. their opinions and exercise their First Amendment rights. Administrator Chris Shaner says he was expecting the fight, but the rules aren't going to change. What we wanted to do is let people know what the policy was, why we put it in place, and how they could comply with it. And that's the key. We, we don't want to stifle anybody's free speech. We just want to ensure that everybody has that opportunity in a safe and secure environment. Amid accusations of something sinister, Capitol Police Chief Charles Tubbs explains the rules aren't one-sided. Everyone will have to follow them. Solidarity, solidarity. Protesters have said they won't and keep making music without a permit in hand. Now, the rules apply to groups with four or more members. They require three days' notice to get a permit. The policy also forces rally organizers to pay for police costs as needed. And there are more public meetings scheduled, right? There yeah. are. There are two. They, they will be on Thursday and also on Saturday. And uh, the policy, though, already went into effect uh, at the start of this month. All right. Thanks so much, Theo.